안녕하세요. Bye guys. Today is medicine day. <laughs> Is it TOS if I say overdosing? Hi! Annyeonghaseyo! <laughs> Drug party! Today's <coughs> new outfit. What the heck? feel much better than yesterday. Yesterday was really easy. Thank you, 감사합니다. 어제보다 나아요. But... Yay, medicine day! <laughs> I'm overdosing myself. Dude, dude. 오늘 화장 잘 됐는데? Morning! Wow! Medicine! 짜잔! I'm gonna add this one in. This one is new to the family. This is for headache. 세치다, <laughs> 세치. Where's my AC remote controller? Getting hot. I'm still in Korea. Whoa, oh, oh. <laughs> ah. <laughs> um wow, I'm high. Just kidding. Uh, unfortunately, I think it's gone, but it's still there. I think. Morning, 안녕하세요. <laughs> if that makes any sense, guys. <laughs> oh, yeah. blah, blah. Sorry I'm late. I had to eat breakfast. Apparently this med, the uh, painkiller for headache, you have to take meds. Uh, sorry, you have to eat breakfast. You have to eat a lot or else you'll have a really bad stomach ache. And last night I couldn't sleep because I had a really bad stomach ache. So yeah, I had to take it with food. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for filling in the blanks, guy. The blah 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 blah. <coughs> uh, I think I'm drinking a lot of. Uh, 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 <laughs> guys, let me just turn this one on and then just read the subtitle. <laughs> 100k? Wow! Really? Here, here. Ta? Oh, 여러... 
여러분 이제 한국어로 얘기할 거예요 아래 밑에 읽고 알아서 번역하세요 <웃음> 뇌가 안 움직여 뇌 어. <웃음> 뇌가 지금 미쳤어 이거 안녕하세요 자막 있으니까 알아서들 번역하세요 For now it's Korean <laughs> uh, But we can probably change it to English I just have to figure out how I mean uh, 그 누구지? Nine Dog told me how you could do it in English But uh, I was lazy I should probably uh, Try to do it later Joey, uh, Joey. Come on, so. So. Hi, hi, hi. How are you, How is everyone doing? for the reason What's up? 좀 애매해요 <웃음> 두통에 막 아직까지 나아진 것 같진 않아 가지고 계속 약을 먹고 있어요 어제 이거를 받았거든요 So I got this yesterday Ooh, Let me just keep this on, why not? Uh, yesterday I got this medicine uh, you know how I was gonna go to the doctors, but I was too lazy because also it kind of sucks uh, when I go to the doctors because right now because of COVID, any symptom that sounds like COVID, they're just gonna give me a lot of COVID related medicine. So, am I muted? So minute. Hello, 안녕하세요. Ah, okay. <laughs> oh, I think Joey's touching stuff. Emma, come on, so. Yeah, come on, so. <laughs> okay. So I just went to the doc. I just went to the pharmacist. 약사한테 가가지고 두통에 좋은 약 주세요 했어요. I just told her, give me the medicine for a really bad headache. And then she goes, oh, uh, like. This is the strongest. She gave me this. And then she's like, this is the strongest. I'm like, okay, well, like, is it is it going to be stronger if I get, like, doctor's prescription? And she's like, no, they usually give you this. And I'm like, okay. I guess I'll just deal with that then. So. So. Just <laughs> 차방전 받는 게 낫는지 아니면 그냥 먹는 게 낫냐고 물어보니까 차라리 여기서 그냥 사는 게 낫다고 차방 받으면 또 돈이 들어가니까 그래서 또 so, anyways 또 so, anyway 또 so, oh. <웃음> I wonder if this can do both Korean and English 이게 한국어랑 영어랑 둘다 되면 좋을 텐데. I look rich? Yeah, I think this design makes me look rich. The English is kind of entertaining. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I'm just saying that there isn't anything, uh, like, it has the same, probably, medication as what's being <laughs> prescribed. 
<laughs> what the heck is super super mercato <laughs> oh my god uh korean's actually very similar korean is very it's recognizing korean much better because it's using google translator <laughs> what the heck So today I was going to go to the golf thing. 오늘 그 골프 관련된 거 가려고 했는데 I think that will be more in the afternoon. And but then uh, other stuff I will do it now. I haven't done stock news in a while and I'm lacking of stuff so. I don't know if you can see the stock news. Ah, what do you think? This is the program coding. This is the one that I have to do. This is the one Julie, Julia, Nimi, Julia, Niminga, I did Julie, Julie, Nimirago, Kessin, the Namda program of Kessin, the Ibuni, E program, Ashogajugo. Igor, take a padacodonio, Gunnan, the site, padacodonio, Kitobu Padan, and there, Kubun, and though you were sitting in there, Kubun and Yomo, the Ponyo child, 동시 통역 같은 게잘 되는지 동시 언어 인식을 잘 하는지 알다시피 지금 한국어만 잘 되고 영어가 잘안 되니까는 Stocks going crazy? Yeah, let's check stock. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Hey, would you stop fighting me? What is this 냥냥 펀치? <laughs> Did you did you invest in Luna? Oh, do you under do you sing Luna? Don't <laughs> worry. <laughs> okay, now can you go down? Oh, guys, guess what? Yesterday? Yeah, I heard about Luna. We saw it yesterday. It went psh, down, right? What to do? Luna. What to do about Luna? It keeps on Luna. Can we go down? Yesterday? Ah, uh, yesterday I was just sick. <laughs> so anyways, uh, before I go on with today's top news, I wanted to say something related to a K drama I watched. <laughs> what the heck is Washington Academy West? Okay, you need to like that thing is bothering me. Uh but anyways, I watched a K drama because I was sick. Because I was at a point where it's just so boring. Oh they got 
드라마를 시작했거든요. 아 이거를 볼걸 그랬어. 좀 미안해 우리 투수한테. I, I felt bad for the uh, viewers who had to watch that cringy one. Cause the one I'm watching right now is really good. 그거 봤어요. 그. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's the name? 이름이 뭐더라? 잠깐만. I'm blinking out. 아 시그널. Who watched the signal? <웃음> 시그널 본 사람. <웃음> you guys didn't watch signal? K drama? 시그널? 안 봤어? 야, yeah, the few years ago one. 그거 그거 그거. 야야야야야야야. 시그널 보네. 시그널 보네. 티리 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 티리. That signal. You guys didn't watch signal? 시그널 안 봤어? Oh my god. So good. I don't know that K drama. <laughs> How did you not? What? Oh my god. You guys should watch Signal. It's so good. 진짜 진짜 강추. 야. Yeah. Well, I think not only that, but the 그 There are some historical things related to the drama. 그게 몰랐는데 그런 사건들이 실제로 있었던 일들이 있더라고요. Yeah, we're gonna buy text overlay. You make no sense. <웃음> 좀 인식 좀 알아봐야 되겠어. 그런가? Ah, uh, not really, but that one was kind of historical. Kind of, yeah, kind of. Hi, Gao. How are you? Yeah, it's on Netflix. So the storyline is like I don't know. The storyline is really hard to explain. But it, you go, it's time slap, time lapping, time shifting travel, and uh, couple of the couple of the detective story that happens in the drama are somewhat real in Korea. There were some real story, and yesterday. Oh, and I wanted to talk to you guys about 공시 공소 공소시효 맞지 이게 that status status of limitation is that what it is in English? 맞아? 스탯 that tooth of limitation that tooth statue statute statute that sounds so weird Sta statute 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 that sounds so weird statute oh statute oh that sounds so weird yeah i think it was more statute <laughs> ah anyways in korean it's 공소시효 and what it's supposed to mean is i mean you guys probably know what it is in english but uh, they were talking about this situation where like i don't know how to explain it right now the scenario was that this girl got this this kid this elementary school girl got kidnapped long time like 20 years ago and right before 
like it was like 10 like an like one day before the limitation was like over i think maybe that's how i should pronounce like uh phrase it that the statute of limitation was uh, the due date maybe it's called the due date i don't know <laughs> i don't know how to phrase it in english it sounds it's really hard but when the due date is when the due date was coming up it was like a day before and they finally expires okay when it expires and the person ended up catching the the murderer but the murder was a girl but the murder was like well if i just let this pass by like a couple of hours this like i'll still be free <laughs> which was so sad so the situation ended up not happening yeah but it happens all in the first episode so <laughs> i thought it was 20 years was it 15 yeah it's such a fast paced story oh it was 15. i guess it depends on the case too but yeah 15 so short it was just so sad. Oh, uh, they used to, but they now, now I think they got rid of it. I think it's not present anymore. <laughs> like, it's been so fun watching murder related, like, crime scenes. Oh my god, those, like, get me so interesting. Interested, not interesting, interested. But the sad part is that like i wouldn't want my relatives to be working in that field because it's so dangerous and people like if you don't catch the murder oh i would i would not be able to sleep What are some good detective shows in US? Dramas in US? I don't think there's any really good detective related dramas. Like US in US. Or I guess, yeah. Foreign films. And then I was like, oh, I can't probably watch any gory stuff from the movie. Because, oh my god. Like, it gets so gory. Like, imagine finding a dead body that's all tied up. And like... Oh. So. Oh, I watch CSI. TV shows or movie, anything. There are good things about True Detective and Minds Hunter. Is that based off real story? It's common thing here in the West. The viewers of true crime story is like 90% female. Cause... 90% of the crime... I don't know if I should say 90, but like a high percentage of people... Is... That... Happen... Like crime happens would be females. So probably... Um... Probably why they watch it just to know how they could deal with it. How they could go over or uh, <laughs> not worry too much about the situation. Something, something, something. <laughs> something, something. But then I also find it super like it really sucks for the detectives because these murders if you're smart as f like there's a tv show recent tv show in korea and oh guys if any if you I honestly think meeting girls meeting people online is really bad <laughs> um because 
I watched this recent crime that happened and it's called date scam law or date scam I think it's dating scam date scam what was it called romance scam date oh it's called romance scam And it's so scary. No, 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 no. Yeah, so what the, what happened? The story um related to this was that so this guy met a girl who a girl. I mean, actually a girl. Yeah, they're using romance to scam you. So they met them like they met each other online. They were actually like phone calling. Um, and then like she took a bunch of pictures, blah blah blah. And one day the girl shit like takes a video because the girl was like, Oh, like I'll go visit Korea um when she's in Seattle. And the girl was like, she took a little footage of the seattle airport and then she texted her like the guy in korea being like oh my god like my mom has this really bad like heart attack going on or like she has some medical like severe medical issue going on like um and she has something wrong with her credit card so can you can, can you like send me some money and the guy was like well like i could send you a bit but like i can't send you the whole amount and the girl like a couple of hours later and it says oh my god my my mom passed away <laughs> so the guy actually felt pressure to give her money so the guy gave her all of like the funeral fine like fee everything like so much money i think he lost up to <sighs> like eighty thousand dollars and how he could earn that much money was that he actually had to quit his job so that he could get you know like money when you but what's that word called but yeah and what else did he have to do and he actually had to leave the house like so that he could use the money from the uh he could use the deposit money to send it over but then one and then like he was actually he ended up being homeless because he had no house and everything so a lot of his friends around him helped him out and he actually ended up reporting to the police but this actually went on for an eight months and the police actually found out that it was a girl this person was a girl how he found out was that through the bank account they uh so he actually sent the money to a korean bank account and so when they re like searched the korean bank account it led to one number that was in seattle but his dad like her dad was in korea so then they called each other or the police called them and figured out that the dad's daughter was doing all of this scam so they brought them they brought her back to korea and had to like you know uh, ask her questions and the only reason she wanted to do this was she just wanted to test out how smart like if this worked or not and so she tried with a bunch of guys and obviously this guy got caught you know in a tra little trap so what was shocking was that she was just she so he couldn't get all of the eighty thousand dollars back he only got a certain part she was just in jail for like five months and so and even when she had was being sent to the jail she didn't feel sorry at all she was just like you're wasting my time <laughs> and that like why are you trying to interfere with my boyfriend and stuff and what was also shocking was that all the pictures she sent were fake so then they asked oh like how did she you know like i thought they were video calling each other and you can't really fake someone when you're video calling and apparently she had to you know she only video called in the dark so that the face wasn't really like fully revealing 
And what was really sad was that when the guy first saw the girl, so the police was like, do you want to see who did the scam to you? And he was like, yeah. And so when they met up at the police station, he was just like so shocked because he's like, this is not the girl I've been talking to. <laughs> um, because it was completely different from all the pictures that she was getting. So very unfortunate. And this happened like two years ago. So don't trust people online, guys. Don't waste your money. Don't spend $80,000 to a random girls. Oh, really? Do they like call random people but you know i did i tell you i got scammed too it just happens also naturally <laughs> you think you'd be like oh my god like i could totally you know get out of the situation but it's just hard <laughs> <laughs> yeah make sure the girl's not random like you actually have to meet her <laughs> in person and be like hey <laughs> do i know you <laughs> It was just so shocking. It's so scary, guys. Yeah, guys, give me eighty thousand dollars. My, uh, my, I have a headache. <laughs> I think I deserve eighty thousand dollars, guys. At least give me. Eight thousand dollars. <laughs> I'll 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 give you guys a ninety percent discount. <laughs> give me eight thousand. Oh, I thought it was just a random Chinese. Oh, I just remember there was a there's a lot of so related to fel face filtering. What I find it interesting was that a lot of um. A lot of streamers use the face filter, so <laughs> it's it's funny. There was one I think Chinese BJ who was using a face filter and she looked completely different that like people started suing her. There's also a Korean girl who also kind of felt like they got scammed because she ended up not using the app so then you could kind of see her and then the chat suddenly had a bunch of question marks and be like who's that <laughs> is that her mom <laughs> oh it's hard guys life is hard life is hard being a streamer you want to look pretty so that people could spend money to you but then you always have to worry about getting risk or work get blah 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 blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. I guess you'll have to worry about getting caught. So. Oh, is this true? Hello. Yeah! No, I know this girl. That's the girl I was thinking of, too. She was 58. I didn't know she was 58. There's someone similar to this. Oh, her real face isn't showing.
I was trying to look for a similar case that happened in Korea, but I couldn't find the pictures. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> I'm blanking out again. Anyways, let's talk about stock guys. <laughs> what? What? Why did it this? Stock time. So tiring today. When am I never tired? So let's just kind of quickly go over because we already saw last week performance except healthcare is doing fine. There's a disclaimer, but there's a rumor that uh, the third wave of COVID is going to come. Some rumor. <laughs> Somewhere in the world, there's a disclaimer with uh, so that people are interested in purchasing healthcare. I, maybe that might be why healthcare is doing so well right now. But, but I think at this point, it's like... <laughs> it's like people are going to just live with COVID. So a couple of news I wanted to talk about. Wasn't the last one the third one? Is it, is it, is the last one third one? We had COVID and then we had... Yeah. What was after COVID? Delta! Okay. Oh. Delta and Omni... Ah... Uh. So last week we wanted to talk about Philip Morris because that's getting abide. You know, open all the links. We want to still talk about inflation. Hmm. I'd rather talk about Disney or FIFA. Maybe we'll talk about this. So hopefully today around one or two will be done and then I could go to the golf uh whatchamacallit Ah uh, no I'm going to a golf expo So let's talk about this one. I think. Is there any other news you guys wanted to tackle? Something that happened in a day? Anything like special? Ooh, Colgate doing good. Damn, they had a nice drop. You know what's also interesting is that if I talk about a stock and then if there's anything that's happening with the stock, then my viewership, my viewer count from my YouTube goes up. <laughs> kind of interesting. Kind of feels like stock. Oh, Colgate's didn't go up. I'm still waiting for Lucid to go up. <laughs> oh, 
What I got a comment of was uh, Gilead. I don't know why people watch this one a lot. Cause I I guess it might be COVID related. Gilead. Yeah. Guys, what to do with my lucid? <laughs> Guys, save, save Lucid for me. Anyways, uh, should we start talking about stock, guys? Are you guys ready to do some communications with me? Guys, also... <laughs> Selling my maid outfit. wants this <laughs> my i forgot about this guys oh thank you yeah i'll sell it for 80k guys <laughs> the 80k dollar worth Sell it on Instagram? Why? I gotta do something with you guys. You guys are just so annoying. Ah, uh, hi, Likeful. I'm your queen. Thanks. <laughs> I don't know if your uh, pizza crew is gonna like the fact that you're calling me queen, though. <laughs> Okay, bye. Every day is such a lazy day for me. Ooh, he keeps on a call. IG followers may be more likely to fit into that? Why? <laughs> <laughs> no guys i think ig is like 99.5 percent female or uh, male i have no female oh well like guys don't buy i don't think they'll buy a maid outfit on instagram would they Anyways, let's uh let's start doing this. Can someone like rip my head off? I'm still getting the headache. I was talking to uh I was talking to who was I talking to Amy the other day related to meds? And she's like, I guess this is common where you just feel so bad after COVID and that like, you just have to deal with it. <laughs> so I'll just deal with it, guys. It's okay. It's not like I'm going to die anytime soon, right? Ah, uh, <clears throat> Let, let's uh, start. I'm going to hide you like this. My taste was never gone. Well, that's that's a shocking thing for me was that I never lost my taste. But all I lost was like I don't Oh, I lost a bit of smell. I could I could realize I lost a bit of smell. I lost my mind. That's the worst thing. <laughs> That's something I can agree on, is that I lost my mind, and I might not want to go to that thing. You gonna get a chance to play golf soon? Uh, I be mm, on stream.
maybe when I play with Timmy, but on stream it's hard unless I go to like par three. But the fee, like, it's been super expensive. So, thank you for the tier one. Uh, thank you for the prime sub. But I need lots of money to play golf in Korea. Like, if I go rounding with Mia, it's five hundred dollars for both of us. Like, not individual, but total. So individually, I'm spending two hundred fifty dollars per every golf course. <laughs> so, yeah, I have to earn that much money if I want to play golf. That's why I haven't been able to go out a lot recently. The fees are just... It makes no sense. It's just so expensive. Driving range isn't fun! <laughs> I mean, I could go to a driving range. Yeah, I, I'll probably stream once or twice. Uh, I will be doing screen golfing with chat this coming Sunday. If you guys are interested, you can come watch it this Sunday. Saturday for you guys, not Sunday. Anyways, let's start news, guys. Who's excited? <laughs> can you see that I'm trying to stall time? Why am I so lazy today? I've been so lazy. Like, I don't want to do this. I should work hard. Yeah. Like, I, yeah. <laughs> so I can use it on, for my YouTube. <laughs> It'd be YouTube content using chat. But it'd be nice if we had one more person, but I guess no one can come that day. Anyways, uh, we start this, guys. It's so long. Now see you. Okay. Ah ah ah. So hi guys. Today we're going to talk about Swedish match agrees to 16 billion takeover by Philip Morris. Oh, so Philip Morris is taking over a Swedish match company, not vice versa. Oh! <laughs> um, acquisition pits tobacco giant against partner Ultra in the rapidly growing market for smoke-free products. What? What is smoke-free products then? So Philip Morris International plans to re-enter the U.S. market through 16 billion acquisition of Swedish Match. Oh, the company name is Swedish Match? Oh, the whole time I was thinking about something else. So how come them acquiring Swedish Match is re-entering U.S. market? I guess this is a U.S. company. Yeah. ABN challenged its partner, Ultra, in the race to dominate smoke-free tobacco products. So some of the products that you guys are mentioning is patches, tobacco, chewing tobacco? There's a chewing tobacco, like gum? I heard the gum doesn't help. I heard if you chew, if you try the chewing tobacco, You'd rather want to... You want to smoke more with the chewing tobacco than not want to smoke. <laughs> so smokeless tobacco maker Swedish Match said Wednesday that its board agreed to a 161 billion Swedish krona cash offer. Oh, which is 16 billion dollars from Philip Morris. <gasps> if you aspire to be truly global leader, you cannot ignore the largest market. In the U.S., there is room for a number of products for a number of players. Ooh, sounds fancy. So Philip Morris in 2008 was spun off from Ultra in a move that gave investors direct access to the faster growing foreign cigarette market. Philip Morris now sells Malibro. Malibro, oh sorry. <laughs> Since I don't know all these uh, tobacco 
maze. Oh my god. So they sell Marlboro, right? And other cigarette brands outside the US and is one of the world's biggest tobacco companies. Ultra sells as smokers look for Ah, Ultra sells Marvel in the US. What? What? Philip Morris International is the non-US company. What? That's so confusing. Ah, so Philip Morris International is different from Philip Morris Philip Morris US. <laughs> what the heck? US is not the same as international. So do they like hate against each other? So they're actually because the US is actually ultra. Ultra. Ultra? I don't think this is ultra. I think this is ultria. Have I been pronouncing this wrong? <laughs> So it's Altria? Altria sells Marlboro in the US. Ah. Uh, okay. As smokers look for less harmful alternatives to cigarette, both companies have sought new revenue sources by investing billions of dollars in the next generation product. Altria in 2018 paid $12.8 billion for a 35% stake in e-cigarette startup. Oh, Jewel! Oh, and then Philip Morris has been more aggressive in making pivot to alternative products aimed to generate more than 50% of net revenue from smoke-free products by 2025. Last year, its smoke-free portfolio led the company's IQOS devices that heat rather than burn tobacco account for about 29% of net revenue. So, so Marlboro International, I know, okay, so recently there has been the heating cigarette and that's been created by Marlboro International. Then what's different from Jules, the e-cigarette? So, wait, e-cigar is liquid. But you still burn tobacco? Is it liquid tobacco then? Or jewels? And then this one you what's the difference between heat and burn? <laughs> ah so you don't burn the liquid here. You just How do you how does how does jewel work guys? <coughs> so isn't jewels also heating up? So they have an internal battery and then some regulator chips, so... How do they heat up? Liquid... Vaping is vaporizing liquid for inhale... Inha inhalation... Inhalation. A heating element vaporized the liquid. Yeah. Then what's the difference between their method of heat rather than burn tobacco? Is it the same thing? Tambe, Yojum hatadan tambe. Can we get a shout out for Suni? Then what's then guys? What is what is the recent tobacco that's been really popular? Who knows about that one? 그 안에 한국에서 요즘 유명한 담배 뭐지? That one's also liquidized. 
Oh, what is that called? A pita stick, yep. I don't know if it's e cigarette or 전자담배가 아니라. 잠깐만요. 와, 아니야, 이거. 선생님, 비타 스틱 이거 나오는데? 담배. 아, 헥? 와, they have vitamin cigarette? 그게 그 전자 담배가 있으면은 그걸 위에 뭐 꽂고 그걸 피는 게 있거든요. So if this is the cigarette, oh that must be heating tobacco then. 아, okay, so I understand. So this is heating up liquid that contains tobacco. 새로 개발된 것 같아요. And then. 그랬던 것 같은데. And then this one is burning, uh, heating up tobacco. I think I know what this means, but it's really hard to explain. <laughs> 되게 헷갈린다. Heated tobacco products are designed to heat tobacco without burning it or producing smoke. The popularity of these products soared in Japan after the release of electronic device called IQOS. So it must be what they're talking about. IQOS. Oh, 이거 이거. Oh, oh. <laughs> you know what sucks about these guys? Is that uh, now I have to start scrolling down. 이안 좋은 게 요즘 이 내려가야 돼요. <laughs> 이게 전자 담배가 아닐 거예요. 전자 담배는 아 이게 아이코스구나. 아 this is Icos. <laughs> 이게 잎을 데피는 거 아니에요? 이게 전자담배라고? 전자담배는 리퀴드가 들어가 있을 것 같은데 충전만 하면 전자담배인가? <웃음> 오 한국어로도 헷갈리겠구나 전자담배 미국에서의 전자담배는 리퀴드가 들어가 있는 게 전자담배인데 이 친구는 또 메커니즘이 다른 게 얘는 나뭇잎을 데핀 다음에 그거를 필수 있는 게이 친구고 전자담배는 그 액체를 데펴서 연기로 만든 다음에 피는 거죠. 이게 찐다고 하구나. 아, 아, 아. Guys, I wanted to try this. 궁금했어. 근데 이게 담배는 안 피는데 이게 신기해가지고. This is actually very popular in Korea too. 아니, I like, I don't want to physically try. 걸련형 전자담배는 뭐예요? 그게 쪄서 하는 건가 이게? 아 이게 그거예요? 어... How much is this? It's 68 dollars. That's so expensive. How does the mechanism work? 좀 자세히 보자 어떻게 되는지. I don't wanna go to GS. Oh, you can test it for 14 days. 체험하기가 있어. Who tried this, guys? Oh, Icos Club이 따로 있네. Oh, they have accessories. <laughs> 이건 뭐야? Hold the cap이야? Oh, clean stick. Tray. Oh, they have tray? So, I guess this might be healthier than burning it. Still not safe according to FDA? Which one is the safest? Well, let's talk about safest after reading this, guys. So, continuing. <laughs> In the US, Swedish magic is largest market followed by scandinavia the smokeless tobacco company zing nicotine pouch brand pouch 
but a category that includes rival offering from Altria, Altria and British to American Tobacco. Dylan Morris plans to use Swedish Match's U.S. sales force and manufacturing operations to make other smoke-free products, including e-cigarettes and possibly IQ, IQOS, IQOS, heated tobacco device. <clears throat> so Altria currently has the exclusive right to sell IQOS in the U.S. Philip Morris has been unhappy with Altria's slow rollout of the product and the two are at odds about whether Altria has met the milestone to renew its license and distribution contract beyond April 2024. Whoa, so this is the Swedish match store. So they sell in this round... Oh, so this must be... The safest cigar is like safe sex. <laughs> what the? <laughs> so you put the you, you put this under your mouth, inside your mouth. Ah, uh, chewing tobacco. Ah, uh, nicotine pouch. Then you just put it inside your mouth, under here. This is nicotine pouch here, and the chewing tobacco is like gum. Oh, uh, 이게 니코틴 껌 같은 거고 니코틴 파우치라고 입술이랑 여기 치아 사이에 넣어서 니코틴을 흡수하는 것도 따로 만든다고 하네. <웃음> 너무 어려운데? We have to reconcile these views. Da 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 da. Import of IQOS to the US were halted last year because of patient dispute with BAT, but sales of the product could resume next year so us isn't using this that much right now without iqos all tria's reduced risk product portfolio would be limited to its on nicotine pouch and its minority stake in jewel so no one uses jewel anymore maybe patent did i say patient <laughs> <laughs> no wonder I was like patient dispute. Wait, what did they do with the patient? Thank you. A patent dispute with that, but sales of the product could resume next year with Philip Morris. <laughs> Sorry. Na 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 na. All Tria share was were down seven percent since Monday because they couldn't get it back under the Swedish match proposal, subject to shareholder. Approval investors in the Stockholm based company will receive 106 Swedish krona equivalent to $10.55 in cash for each share held. So, demand in the US is growing for next generation tobacco alternatives. Vaping product sale in US stores tracked by Nel Nelson increased 11% in the 52 weeks ended April 23rd compared with the previous year. The U.S. vaping market is led by Jules Lab and Reynolds American INC, a subsidiary of BAT. Meanwhile, nicotine pouch, what is Lozang, Lozangs? <laughs> are driving growth in the oral tobacco category, which includes traditional chewing tobacco and moist snuff. Moist snuff? Like... Ah, uh, low... Los lo, lozenges is like cough drop, you know. So nicotine pouch contains nicotine and flavoring, but no tobacco. <laughs> Lo ze Lo zen Lo zenges Lo lo genzes oh, Wow So the US Food and Drug Administration in 2019 uh, authorized Swedish Match to market its general snus 
smokeless tobacco products as presenting a lower risk of mouth cancer, heart disease, and lung cancer than cigarettes. The FDA also has authorized Philip Morris to tell consumers that switching from cigarettes to IQOS significantly reduces the body exposure to harmful, harmful chemicals. Wow, I learned so much about tobacco in this one article. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, so let's talk about this Swedish match and Philip Morris. So, a couple of questions related to this. I don't know if because of this, Philip Morris's recent stock price has increased. To about three percent last week because they were doing a poor job during March but then around like yesterday this week people started buying Philip Morris stock so either they're really happy that Philip Morris International is coming to the US market but a couple of questions I have in seeing this takeover is do people actually use these products like the well, yeah, smoke free products is my first question and then if they were to use it And if they do use it a lot, is it better than the IQOS? Because it seems right now, US isn't using much of the IQOS. Uh, probably other international companies are using it. So would they be interested in doing more of the smoke-free? I guess they're more into focusing on the smoke-free rather than the heating up method. Ah, SNS, SNUS is this one? The Swedish match. So, what do you guys think? What are your thoughts? First question: Who have seen people use the smoke-free chewing tobacco? I see it all the time. Really? It's a product that has addictive qualities. Oh. What's tobacco dip? All men chew tobacco? Oh! So there's more chewing than smoking nowadays? Which one? If you guys were to pick between chewing tobacco and uh, smoking tobacco, which one would you pick? But here, I would like to say that there is a gum, but there is a gum, so I would like to say that there is a gum. Oh, okay. Guys, if you were had to smoke... <laughs> guys, if we... if you guys had 
to smoke. <laughs> Which one would you choose? <laughs> Morning, Koa. <laughs> ah, cause of second is smoky. So I have a question, guys. So it seems that smoke free is more disgusting, but causes less secondhand smoking. Well, you know what I think about this smoke-free? If this gets lots of spit, does that, doesn't that mean I have to spit on the floor a lot? Like, <laughs> half the time I'd be spitting on the floor with all the crabs. So, doesn't that also, it's not environmentally friendly? <laughs> Is it smart to have... Oh, you have a... In a bucket? Oh, they carry around a bucket or a cup to spit? <laughs> what? <laughs> Ew! So they just like... Like that? What if someone drinks that empty beer can? How will they know it's a split spit spit bottle? <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, that's so disgusting. So Oh, it smells bad. Oh. Ew. What are some good questions to talk about more about this? How can we analyze this? So in the long term, which one do you think is more profitable? Swedish matchy. <laughs> ah, na jinta. I want to shoot my brain. Ah, jinta, nega an dolaga. Ah, my brain. Ah, I hate COVID. It killed my brain cell. Oh my god. I'm so tired. 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 I'm What should we talk about this one, guys? What are some good things to talk about this article? Guys, use your brain for me. <laughs> uh... What are some things we could talk about this article? <laughs> Wait, let me let me talk about let me kind of think. Oh, I did a brain fart. Should we just get rid of this article? Should we not upload this? I cause uh, this week, Philip Morris is the only stock that's been 
I mean, not only, but like one of the stock that's been up, and I'm guessing because of this, and that they see potential in. <sighs> Just give me like five minutes to like think. Actually. Can we have like five minute break time? Cause let me just like chill my brain out. <laughs> so that I can think what we can talk about. I feel like a lot of people still. This is already so bad for you that I don't know what we could talk about. What's grain future? Oh, 진짜 나 이번 주랑 저번 주 머리가 진짜 답이 없다. Oh, last week and this week, my brain is not functioning. Oh, this never happens, so I don't know what to do. <laughs> Can we just go IRL? <laughs> ah, what to do? What to do with my brain, guys? Ah. Yeah. Well, I rested all day yesterday. I slept a lot. Actually, I didn't. I didn't take a nap yesterday. Actually, I worked. <laughs> I have confession to make. I worked yesterday. Oh, just half kick so so so. I had no time. Well, I didn't even get to write a lot. Half kick so body so so. Don't move body up, guys. That's why I started signal, guys. Talk about. Oh, anyways, let's brainstorm. Oh, 진짜 내가 터질 것 같아. Okay, brainstorm, guys. We can do it. Fighting. So you know how I'm going to lead the story for this one. I think I should list all the equilibrium. <laughs> Okay, so I need you guys' help. Work with my work with my like useless brain right now. <laughs> so I'm going to list all the smoke related products and then divide up which one is related to Philip Morris International versus Altria. And then see which one is more popular nowadays and try to figure out maybe in the future they'll be citing more towards smoke-free products. And maybe we should compare it with jewels. Because Jules is uh, Altria, and then Anga, yeah, 
And then the IQOS is... Philip Morris? <coughs> That's a lot of stuff? Okay, maybe we'll shorten it down then. Okay, Henry's back. Okay, so question for this article is... I think first we need to figure out... Oh, first, I, my first question is... Is, like, cigar slash cigarette... Now dying? Like, is this product actually not being able to survive in all these e-cigarette or smoke-free? Because people actually don't like cigar slash cigarettes since... You know, second in smoking. And it probably smells bad. So do you think this will now start to die out? And then the rise of uh, e-cigar. Or smoke-free is going to allow. Not for a while. But... Don't you see? Maybe there is a possibility that the cigarette's going to someday die out. But I did hear lots of people say, ah, uh, sometimes cigarette tastes better than all the new products out there. I think this is kind of related to when we talk about veggie burgers. You know how vegetarians don't want burgers out there, uh, meat, meat burgers, but you know, it's really hard for us to say, okay, well, you guys must make something that tastes as good as meat. But that's always a hard thing to do. So maybe it's going to be similar. It's dying, but still popular in less developed countries. But not for a while. They only die when they get banned. Oh, probably. Traditional boomers will always smoke. Mmm... So right now, the competition between Philip Morris International is Altria. And Altria made Jules, which is vape, e-vape, versus Philip Morris, who invested in IQOS, which actually started in Japan, which is... Uh, IQOS is more of heating, which we learned. So if you were to smoke either Jules or IQS, which one would you prefer? I guess which one... Since we're not a heavy smoker, we don't know which one is good in terms of smoker's taste. But... Whichever is cheaper, oh... Because for Jules, I think these vapes cost a lot, not gonna lie. And probably... This is, the device was, was like $60, but you could probably insert the regular cigar. paper <laughs> pack cigar, right? And then Jules is thirty dollars. And then twenty dollars per like oil? Ah, uh, you call it oil, not liquid. How much is the cigarette thingy for IQS? Cause we just found out that $60 for the device. 종이로 말아서 파는... 시중에서 지금 파는 게 그거 아닌가? Wait, I actually have to figure out how this IQS works. Because I think the, the, the thing that goes in it
Wow, this one's so pretty. <laughs> Yogi, can't you just... Can't you just put the red, just recent day cigarette here? And then smoke it? Or vape it? Or like, heat it? Depends on whether people want actual tobacco taste. Some people vape with other flavor e-juice. Oh... 그러니까 여기에 우리가 일반 담배를 여기다 끼는 거죠. 그리고 그거 자체를 데피는 방식이죠. 아 이것도 따로 전용이 있어? 전용은 얼마예요? 아, so they have a different. So it seems that IQS has a different, different. Type of cigar, uh, cigarette, their own cigarette that's related, but the cost is same as regular cigarette. Yeah, she. This cigarette business is also so complicated, and they're involving so much. So IQS isn't popular in the U.S. right now, then. So that's why you guys haven't heard about the methodology of how this works ah because it's international company so if this were to come to the us maybe people were going to start changing to this one because there's been lots of great feedback on the iqos because it probably tastes the same oh. Mm. And the reason why they have a better feedback is that they actually taste similar to regular cigarettes. So that's why Koreans are using this one a lot. They actually use the Icos. I in Korea, they call it Icos. I don't know what they would call it in US. Probably the same. But I think they have a similar taste of all different methodology that to a regular cigarette. So they're that's why they're favoring the icos more. Even if it's not like the methodology is different from burning versus heating. So yeah. Let's not use this one. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going with the cigarette one. Ah, 뭔가 뭐가 잘하면 이거를 유튜브 각 찍을 수 있을 것 같은데. 내가 안 움직여. Do we? Because then I don't have anything to post on my stock content. Oh, let's take a break. Ah, what do you Guys, programming is also brain, brain working. <笑><笑>あ、プレイン、プリーズワーク。ガイズ。<笑> What should we do? I don't know about the damage, so I wanted to do a conversation with Charlie and Tuzz to put it on YouTube. I wanted to put it on YouTube. But I didn't think of that. I wanted to do it. I wanted to do it. I wanted to do it. I wanted to Jewel had a 41% market share in US. Wow. Ah, down from 72. Guys, what do you guys smoke more in US then?
Ah, okay, okay. Da Takawa, I have a, I have a, okay. I'm going to, I'm going to start the conversation like this. Let's redo it. <laughs> da ilgokko. Da ilgokko. Jinri read everything. Da ilgokko. Okay, so, question. <laughs> Yo, do we have any smokers in chat, guys? That's a good question. Who smokes? You used to. Oh. I think we have a lot of non smokers on chat. IQS, IQOS가 지금 미국에서는 안 쓴다고 하니까는 그게 만약에 시장에 들어오게 된다면 과연 그거가 가능성이 있는지 지금 현재 줄이 41%면은 해야 되겠다. 진짜요? Who smoked a cigar before? Guys, I heard if you smoke cigar, that's like the legit thing to smoke. Sorry, this this cigarette conversation's been going on for too long. Sorry, guys. Maybe I, I it's it's a good time to move on. Aja, cigarette, cigar, take me so Never smoked anything. Oh, cigar is different from cigarette. How is cigar made? We have only one smoker. <laughs> No wonder this is hard to talk about. <laughs> we don't know anything about cigarette. A quick joke is there? Cigar are all tobacco. Then what cigarette? Do they have other substance inside? Mm. What the heck is Cuban cigar? <laughs> that sounds so fancy. There's a Cuban cigar. Is Cuban known for cigars? Well, obviously, but why does it have to be specifically from Cuba? <laughs> now, my friend was from Cuba, like she was born in... Born in Cuba, so I always called her Cubic. Because <laughs> I thought, like, it, I thought instead of reading it as Cuban, I thought it was Cubic for the longest time. Like, yo, you're a Cubic person? And then she made fun of me, so I was like, oh, wait. <laughs> oh, we have one person who smokes here. One? <laughs> That's so sad, G. <laughs> Okay, redoing this, guys. Redoing. Cuban cigars were banned from U.S. Oh, really? They're not readily available in U.S. Oh, what? Cigarette smokers usually inhale. Yeah, I heard you're not supposed to inhale cigars. Okay, so after reading this, guys, a couple of questions come to my mind. So in the U.S., I think a lot of people are using what... You said 41% of people are using jewels. Which isn't that bad. I, do you have other other percentage of what people are using? Wait, if 41% people are using jewels of all the smokers? So people are using so 41 of vape more like we don't know if it's jewels. So then rest 59 is still probably, I'm guessing, cigarette?
Or are you saying uh, 41% of all the vapes? Wait, is there a... A vape to get for... Ah, of all the vapes, 41% use uh, jewels and the 59 is other, other brand. Ah, damn it. So do you guys know the ratio of what people smoke? Is that available? Because my question is, even if there are so many alternatives, like we have what was mentioned of chewing, pouchy, e-cigar, more heating cigar. <laughs> Gosh, I learned so much about cigarette, guys. I already know everything. How come people are still going back to smoking? Regular cigarette. Cigarette. Probably because of uh, the taste. I think it has a big component to the addiction. Even if they have everything that's... If, even if all the alternatives have similar substance inside you can't win against the taste of smoking cigarette social i think it also has to do with like coolness like honestly what would look cool guys if you have a cigarette in your mouth versus Oh guys, let me let me get my pack of pack of uh, gum. Meow 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 meow. <laughs> know what I mean? Maybe not to some people, but among your smoking friend group, I think it won't look that cool. And I think the biggest reason why people like cigarette more is the fact that when you cigarette, when you try to blow out, it actually feels better than like chewing and spitting. Because <laughs> I would also rather like blow out smoke because it's like you're giving the action of sighing like Oh, right? Then being like, hey, <laughs> right? So <clears throat> that's probably why all these alternatives aren't that popular amongst people. Although they still do it, they usually do this plus smoking, <laughs> which I find is so funny. Keep on telling me. Uh, they also have this feeling of like numbness spacing out so smokers are shunned we have to smoke away from the non-smokers can you imagine being a smoker with current cigarette price how much is the current cigarette price though? Is it like fifteen dollars? Fifteen, sixteen dollars in US. Twenty five for two pack? Yeah, so fifteen fifteen. That's what I think they start make they start rolling their own. They start making their own. I think it's better cheaper to buy um the leaves and then the paper and just roll it on your own with the filter than actually buying the pack of cigarette. But it's very addicting, so they still probably won't mind the price anyways. Like it's like saying why are you buying so much for alcohol, right? You know, you're just addicted to it.
Yeah, but I doubt people are going to... I think it's really hard to make people stop smoking it. <clears throat> so guys, what are some ways for Philip Morris to convince people to use other products? Such as... Well, Jules is actually, like we mentioned earlier, from Ultra. So it, it's kind of hard to say, hey, you guys should use more of Jules because it's being popular. But I know you guys didn't hear about the IQ... Icos? I um, which isn't that popular in the US, but in Korea, it's like, not just uh, maybe making an assumption 90 people smoke this thing. <laughs> not gonna lie. Everyone has a, like a device uh, when you're smoking outside. <laughs> kind of scary. <clears throat> a lot of people do. So, what I find that interesting is. Would Icos succeed if it's now being introduced in the US market versus Jewel? Or do you think people would still prefer Jewels or regular cigarettes? But honestly, if you are a really heavy smoker person, wouldn't you already know about Icos? Like, we are just regular individuals and we haven't heard about it and that we don't really understand the mechanism. But if you're a heavy smoker, I feel like you would know what this Icos thing is. Or like, try to buy it internationally because if you're a heavy smoker, you would want to try something that's really cool, right? Maybe not so Swedish match you guys are so happy to do so it didn't get a new lounge well on the on the on this on this got on the so let's end it simple and say since we are not heavy smokers <laughs> we don't know much about how smoking works but People just pop into the store to buy a pack of cigarettes. They won't really stray away from what they're most familiar with. Oh, that's true. Probably only if they were looking for options to regular cigarettes. So you... So maybe not that many people might use Icos. Yeah. I guess Koreans are good at following the trend, but in US, it's really hard to change people change people's uh laziness <laughs> i don't know if i should call it laziness but i think it's really hard to do marketing in u.s because everyone and every country or every state is different compared to how it works in korea anyway it's going to end this smoke talk i don't know if i'm gonna upload it but <laughs> i want to say my brain's not working so sorry for a bad conversation <laughs> um anyway so End of story. Smoking. I think... I want to see the US reaction to Icos because, like I said, it is pretty popular in Korea because a couple of the feedback we're getting related to smoking or Icos is that they have a nice taste or they have taste similar to regular cigarette however as you guys all know smoking is bad so try not to smoke but we will see if Philip Morris International acquiring Swedish match will do any good for them I know their stock prices right now has increased to 3% around approximately so We'll see how they will do in the future and how they will go against their rival, Altria. So that's all I could think about this because I don't smoke. <laughs> Smoking is so hard content to talk about. <laughs> so, yeah. If you guys ever find what... If you ever find people smoking Icos, like to look into it. Don't actually try it i don't want to say try it but it's pretty a cool mechanism and that there's less smoke and smell compared to regular cigarettes so yeah
that's all for this one. Morning, Koa. This one was hard. I don't like cigarette conversation. <laughs> it was very hard. <laughs> I don't know. Did you say morning? Even I don't remember. Today's been a hard content day, guys. I've been having... I spent... I wasted an hour... Frying my brain out. <laughs> Hi, Dust. How are you? Uh, so it wasn't going well. But thanks for uh, putting up with me, guys. It was interesting. <laughs> my brain's just not working. It's like... So mom... Like, COVID turned the switch off. I am better, but my headache is not going away. And they said this is a very strong pill, but this pill isn't helping. Isn't that shocking? So I don't know what to do. Yeah, hi, Zig. I'm good. I'm... I guess I'm good. It's... It's a bit tiring. So... Guys, I don't know if you guys saw, but there is a schedule up this week. New schedule up. Kind of new schedule up. So if you guys are interested, check it out. Perhaps looking at screen all day doesn't help situation. Yeah. <laughs> and I was supposed to rest yesterday, but I ended up working. That was. Should not have worked, but I ended up working. Why? <clears throat> you get paid to not work i don't get paid to not work i would love to get paid to not work i want to pay oh oh it's, uh, i don't want to work Should I just do a brainless content, guys? I have this. <laughs> Should I just make this, guys? Ah, <laughs> uh, so many good news out there, and I want to do it, but... This is called... Uh, Yangmo Pelt. Yeah, it's a crafty thingy. Oh, it's made in China. <laughs> the sad thing, Koa, is that I want to do stock. Not gonna lie, I want to do it because it's fun. But at the same time, my brain's just not working. Like I don't know why. It's just not speaking to me. It's it's just yelling at me, being like, "Sucks to be you." <laughs> it does suck, and not gonna lie, I just. I should have rested. Even yesterday, when I turned off stream and I rested for, until it was like 2 p.m., I was like, I'm kind of bored. Should I just stream? <laughs> but then I was like, I had nothing to do anyways. <laughs> so. Let's talk about Pixel. Actually, a lot of Pixel lovers in love with this news. No. 
Hi, Pikmin. No. I already have a watch and a bun. <laughs> I don't think... If someone's gonna buy it for me, I'll try it, but... I don't think I'll buy it with my own money. Quoted very well the other day. Oh, good for you. <laughs> Is this how the bun looks? I don't know if I like it though. Oh, seven pros coming out. The only tech accessory I want is a new laptop. I kind of want a gaming laptop so that if I go travel, that I can still do my stock and programming content. But I guess I have to save up for it. There's too many things that I want, but too little I have. <laughs> <clears throat> oh yeah, I forgot about my camera. Yeah. Because I do more of PC stream than IRL stream, so it's, it makes sense for me to get a new camera. Oh, uh, yeah. Starting... June. I might start a... Don't know bar. <laughs> oh my god, my brain! Oh my god, my brain is not working. Can someone tell my brain to work? Can someone just like go inside my brain and be like, Hi, are you okay? <laughs> like tell it to wake up or something. Like slap the heck out of my brain, guys. Oh my god. Oh, it's so awful. Yeah, it seems like a really bad leg. Asus 13, 13 and 14 inch models are a better deal. They're still like a thousand, two thousand dollars, right? Because if I'm thinking about getting a camera and lighting, that's gonna be like what? Three, four K. I'd have to spend. Lighting just gets so expensive. How did people go back working? Okay, I can do it. I see that. Ah, I don't know how you guys work. Let's talk about... Okay, things that ASAP. Let's talk about Rivian. I was like... Okay for like a couple of days. <laughs> so who invested in Rivian? <laughs> Maybe right now is a good time to buy Rivian then. <laughs> it dropped so much. <gasps> wow. Oh, no. What are they going to do with this? <gasps> it's at $24? Well, I saw it at like... Wait, did I buy Rivian? Uncle Mon? Guys, I don't wait. I didn't buy Rivian, guys, right? Chunkama? <laughs> Suddenly, I remember the. I know I bought Lucid, but.
I was thinking about buying it, but I don't think I did. Is that my password? Oh. I'm plus a hundred twenty three dollars. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! For the day. How much did I invest in, guys? Did I invest in three K or five K? Wait, I invested in 5k, but I have $3,000 left. <laughs> Where? Why? Why did it drop? But it says, uh, but I'm green. Well, starting in January, you went down. Oh, shoot, it's... Ah, uh, it's per day? Ish. Maybe we'll invest in other things. I bought Lucid at fifteen dollars. Oh, I'm down by a couple of cents for Lucid. Oh! What? Wait. Ah! No, never mind! Oh, I bought it at $38. Oh, I'm all red. <laughs> ah! Guys, I I lost. I should have I should have sold a couple of them. Let's all I'm going to buy next tomorrow. Damn it. What should I buy? Maybe I should buy more lucid then. <laughs> You made. Give me back my money, Koa! Give me back my 2K! You stole my 2K from me, Koa! <laughs> Should we have Soju? <coughs> I think soju today. I thought I I just I thought I invested in Rivian. I guess I did it. If I drink soju, I think my liver's gonna to die. <gasps> wow, everything went really, everything went down a lot. Wow, charge point is at $10.
びちょっとそこもわあ I lost to 50% in charge point わあ I lost to 70% in globe wait this one was doing so well Wow! Cause I bought it at sixty. Oh, the you just bought it? You just bought it? January. I bought it at the highest. Hi. Should I sell this one then? When the Lucid is 62. <laughs> And yeah, I don't think I should sell now. I just have to wait. What did I buy? What's DK? What DK is your word? Dude, I bought dicks and that's also down 20%. When did I buy dicks? Yeah, I might buy more offset. Oh, really? Tesla's like... I don't want to buy Tesla now. <laughs> But you guys are saying Tesla's overpriced. Oh. I think... Maybe I'll try different stuff. Anyways. Oh, this stock is so difficult. Actually, stock is really hard. It's okay. I can yoink my brother's money. I can yoink you guys' money. <sighs> What a sad day, guys. Today is a sad day. I think nowadays market's not gonna go up anytime soon. <laughs> I should have sold one stock where I was up a bit. Ainga? Well, anyways, let's move on. Let's talk about Rivian, guys. Today, I think I'll go to the golf expo at a later time because uh, I'm not feeling good. Actually, I'm feeling okay. Actually, I don't know how I'm feeling. How am I? <laughs> Actually, it's like what the heck. <laughs> Anyways, let's talk about Rivian. Stop with this brain fart. Like I really want to go because I think it'll help with my business that I'm trying to do as well. But at the same time, uh. It's a different expo. I'm not going to the play expo. But. I don't know if I want to risk getting more fatigue. Like, I don't know if I go there and then I'll feel worse the next day. <laughs> uh, there's so many expos out there right now, so. I do want to make it to a couple of them. I think, I don't know why, month of May, there's a lot of things that's happening, so. Hoping to go. Hoping you'll be fine. Dang. Anyways, let's talk about Rivian. No time to waste. 
Okay, guys, so today we're being. Oh, how's every stock down so much? We have to wait. Thank you, Natsu. Okay, guys, so today Rivian CEO says its chip shortage problem will ease this year. Quarterly report comes after EV Maker cut its 2022 production forecast in half early this year because of parts and material constraints. Is that why their stock price is so down? Electric vehicle startup Rivian maintained its production forecast for 2022 with executives saying the supply chain problems that have stifled its factory output in recent months are expected to ease later this year. Rivian, which reported quarterly results after the market closed Wednesday, said revenue for the first quarter was $95 million. $95 million? Is this still considered small? The company's uh, net loss nearly quadrupled in $1.6 billion for the January to March period compared with $440 million in the prior year quarter. As the company continued to spread heavily on R&D and manufacturing of its first vehicle, Rivian said higher logistic costs also weighed on results due in part to higher spending on ex expedited shipping as a workaround to supply chain disrupt disruption. Since the end of March, the company has stopped assembly lines for longer than anticipated period. Why? Leading it to lose about a quarter of its planned production because of supply constraint. Oh. So probably not like not that much of uh GPU? GPU? GPU slash GPU Isn't that one of the biggest supply constraints? What other things? I keep thinking about wood, guys, from building houses, but I don't think you you have wood in a car. What else are they missing for supplies? Metal from Australia, basically paying a premium to get parts shipped from China. Ah, China. But I thought ah, cause China's everything shut down. Metal. Uh. Australia was all but closed for the past few years. I thought they were they were doing okay in production for Australia. Or at least their COVID situation or am I getting confused with New Zealand? Because I thought their COVID situation wasn't that bad, so are they actually doing bad? Oh, they weren't exporting? Okay, well, continuing, Chief Executive said he has been working with suppliers to ensure more parts and believes that company is moving past earlier obstacles it had with getting semiconductors. Oh, that's what I was looking for, not GPU, CPU, semiconductors. He said Rivian plans to add a second factory shift in the latter half of this year. We've seen really the worst of it, or sort of the valley, if you will, or the supply constraint. Rivian executives said the company's losses should narrow as it begins to make full use of its factory in Illinois, a factory that can produce 150,000 vehicles a year. The company manufactured 2,553 vehicles and delivered 1,227 of them. For during the three month period I feel like this number is so small if you compare this with like Toyota or Ford so maybe a couple of the suppliers don't want to support Rivian 
The quarterly report follows a multi-week slide in Rivian stock price, which hit all an all-time low this week and is trading at nearly a quarter of its initial offering price of $78 a share. Wow. Following the result, Rivian share rose 7% in after house trading. Before that, the stock fell 9.6% during the regular session, closing at $20 a share. That's $50 loss. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's all time high. They are very early on in their S curve. Uh... They're super tiny compared to Ford and Toyota. My friend works there and was part of bringing up their manufacturing plant. Oh, how'd your friend feel about it? So they delivered less than 1% of vehicles to customers. Yeah. <laughs> they still have more to go. Uh, Automaker was among a handful of EV-focused startups that went public last year. Tapping Wall Street zeal for the auto industry's transition to electric. But this year has proven challenging for the young company, which has struggled to increase production of its first two models, which went both on sale last fall. Like other automakers, Rivian is confronting rising raw material costs. So I guess because of COVID, this also has been increasing particularly on ingredients needed to manufacture batteries and trouble securing enough semiconductors and other parts to fully run the assembly line. Rivian in March cut its 2022 production forecast to 25k vehicles, citing supply chain and logistic difficulties. The company said it otherwise would have produced 50k trucks and SUVs. Rivian reported an adjusted loss of 1.43 a share for the first quarter compared with analyst expectation of loss of 1.37 a share. So they lost more than expected. <coughs> <coughs> Obstacles facing the broader global auto industry are falling hard on startup like Rivian, which have yet to build the type of clout with suppliers that some of their well-established competitors have amassed over decades. Yeah. Because I know you guys are saying, you know, they're doing, they're a small company and yada yada yada, but they got so much funding. <laughs> you know how much funding they got? But I guess a lot of reasons why their company isn't doing that well and their stock prices. A lot of the big companies are also. Stepping out of investing in Rivian, which kind of hints on their deal. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, that's the thing. I'm saying they have, they should be doing their best. I feel like they, they keep blaming the common issues that they're having. Yeah, I just think that they're not doing a good job of managing right now. I mean, it is a bad timing because of the COVID pandemic, but... You know, like... <laughs> it's just so small, like only 2k? I, I find this number very small. Tesla had a rocky start too, so maybe they can pull through though. That's why I actually invested more around more for Lucid than Rivian because there's a lot of members from Tesla who is in Lucid and those members were there when Tesla had hard times so I feel like they had more they know what to do in this situation but I just feel like Rivian the only person that kind of stood out probably is the CEO <laughs> and I don't know I just I don't 
I didn't like Rivian from the start, even if I did their anal analyzing thingy. Car market is notorious to break through unless you're a very big name brand. Oh, yeah. And when they started, not many cared about EVs. Yeah, not that many people care anymore about EVs. Ah. Uh... Yeah. Poor Rivian. Sucks to be them. <laughs> they gotta work harder. Like, they have to work smarter and efficient. I guess they're at a place where they can't do anything if the suppliers aren't helping them out. Like, they can't just go out and, like, make their own materials, right? Rivian share has been in sharp decline since the IPO, which we saw. So stock sank to an all-time low Monday. An early investor in Rivian said that sold about 8% of his stock holding. Before sold 8%. Ah, oh, following the expiry expiration of a IPO post IPO lockup period. <gasps> well, I knew this was going to come because they stopped the deal with them anyways. So they continued to slide this week ahead of a quarterly report and are down more than 80% from the start of the year. As a Wednesday close, Rivian's market value stood at $17.9 billion. The company's tumbling share price has weighed on earnings for both Ford, which held about 102 million shares. Another early investors with a roughly 18% stake in Rivian. Both Ford and Amazon swung to a loss in the first quarter as a result of declines in the market value of their Rivian holding. Yeah, even Lucid has also cut production forecast and rising price raised prices in recent months. has highlighted that demand is there for its model, citing 90 reservations as of May 9th. 90,000 reservations, guys. They have to make 90,000 cars. And 100,000 vehicle order from Amazon for electric van. But now they're working with suppliers to ease the bottleneck. <sighs> So Rivian is, I guess, because they have to make, what, almost 200,000k cars, they are making another factory, $5 billion factory in Georgia, which would produce a more affordable EV called R2. Production is expected to start in 2024, and the company said it believes it could accomplish this goal with its current cash. Rivian executives said they were slashing R&D spending by simplifying their future vehicle lineup to conserve cash. On Wednesday, CEO said he didn't foresee an immediate problem with this Rivian getting battery supply. Adding this is a long-term problem for the car sector as demand increases. So Rivian predicted 225,000 cars for this year, but have only made 55,000 cars since September. And recalling 500 trucks as well. So they still have to make 20,000 cars. Oh, I don't know why they would want to be in the car business it's so risky i feel like there's so many things to worry about uh, i don't know how people do production as business personally i think it's too too risky like there's too many things i have to risk so <clears throat> wait so they made since September. They sold September ooh, 10, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2. So, eight months. It took them eight months to make 
to make 5,000, 5k cars. Uh, and they have to make and in seven months they have to make 20k cars to meet their expectation expectation car for this year <gasps> do you guys think rivian do you think it's possible for rivian to do make 20ks by 2023 <laughs> so who thinks rivian is kind of over overvalued Right now, Rivian is blaming supply issue, which we already talked about since um, COVID situation in China is bad. So that's probably one of their biggest supplier. We also talked about Australia, which is a huge metal uh, product, pr production country. So that's also been an issue. And then another thing that they said was Rivian reported a net loss of 1.6 in the first quarter of sale of just net loss of 1.6 billion? So, a uh, question for me is, would they, can they survive the next five years to ramp up? That's a good question. Guys, what happens if Rivian gets bankrupt? Does the CEO go to jail? <laughs> Nintendo changed to a Japanese supplier? Ah! <sighs> Man, what happens to this company? That's a douchebag move. Can he get a new job? His title is going to be wrecked after losing this much. So... So RJ right now is like, ah, hey, don't worry. This problem will end the uh, this end of this year. But do you think he's bluffing? <laughs> because the rea reality wise is, is this really something that like <laughs> he could keep up with? Yeah, so he's saying, I guess the chip shortage problem will ease this year. Someone else wanting to get into electric vehicle would buy them up if the stock keeps going down. Ah. Well, who wants to buy Rivian? Failed CEO get new job all the time given they can give excuses? Oh. Ah. So, question that we come up, we want to think about in terms of Rivian is what Josh said, in five years, will they be able to survive? And what would they have to do for survival? Probably get new new supplier. Does it have to be China? Can't it be like Mexico? Or any Latin American countries famous for um supply being a huge supplier. I know China is cheap, but if you're not if you're making only like what 5k cars in eight months, like when are you gonna make 20k? Even if they haven't been able to ramp up the 
They have actual functioning product. Oh. Do they have an operating margin right now? That's a good question. And the fact that the company's net loss nearly quadrupled to $1.6 billion. Uh, any car company that has money would buy them to eliminate them as competitors. But if it's so bad, I don't even want to buy it though. Because Rivian was known for their skater technology, skater board technology, where the bottom of the panel, because usually the battery is in the middle, is at the bottom, so it looks like a skateboard with a battery on it. So that's, that might be a good patent for technology that our companies would want to take, since Ford initially was going to use this technology and then create their what is, what's their car it's not genesis their fancy car using it so yeah i think they would rather watch them get bankrupt since at this rate i feel like they're having a hard time and for me i just feel like the ceo is kind of bluffing right now is being like it's not a big problem but you know if People are saying there the next wave of COVID is going to hit again where people are a lot of people are also gonna get caught and blah blah blah. There's no way <laughs> other country, at least China or them, are going to open up and do something. So we'll see how things go with Rivian. Um I don't think we'll see him in jail, unfortunately, but for them to survive in not even five years, in the next couple of years. If they don't have a huge investor investing in them and helping out with their next manufacturing uh, factory in Georgia, if that company, if that factory doesn't go well, then I don't see any future in them. Yeah, Ford has already dumped a couple of shares. So, yeah, they sold about 8%. Ford sold 8%. So, it's unfortunate, but good luck. <laughs> Rivian will be something interesting to look in the future, I think, because it's another EV company. But I think the hype about EVs have been dropping and that people are fo focusing more towards drones. I think drones have more potentials right now than EVs. So... There goes all my EV stocks, haha, <laughs> cause charge point is also dropping. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> I hate EVs. Why did I invest in EVs? There was a time when I invested in electric vehicles cause I had two e electric vehicle companies that I reviewed. Uh, Rivian was one of them and uh, lucid but I think if I want Tesla I would have dropped a lot <coughs> oh I have such a bad headache Never seen seen Rivian car before? Cause only what it's like it's like saying I've never seen Jinri's viewer IRL before. <laughs> I only sold 5k cars. <laughs>
90s? Really? Wow. I think delivery is the biggest issue. Or production. That's why... Oh, they're actually in San Jose. You've seen them in San Jose. I feel like they would also be more in like the Midwest where people drive a lot of trucks. You don't really drive trucks down at like downtown areas though, do you? I don't see people driving trucks. Did he, did he purchase one or did he get one for free? I'll be back. I have to make a phone call. Talk about you. Because we, we, we trust in uh, lithium. Uh, lithium. <laughs> lithium. 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 I. 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 Guys, if I were to open a booth, I would have to invite my interns, like my Korean interns. If it can scan it better and find it better, yeah, that's so worthwhile. Um, I'm going to see if they can we can visit their manufacturing or their research lab I'm and back. look into their product more and learn about it. I think I should create. Sorry, my mom called. I bought her golf gloves. Hi, Daddy. It's okay. You're late. <laughs> welcome, welcome. So we did Rivian. Wow, slowly and surely. Guys, I will be going to the... Oh no, I bought her air fryer. The golf thing she wanted early, like later. So I also bought her that too. Let me show you the air fryer. <laughs> my mom's gift yeah i got her the air fryer so oh 
But my mom, when she got the gift, instead of saying thank you, I don't know, this Asian mom thing, instead of saying thank you, she was like, oh, but I don't know if I'm going to use it. So I, I might just leave it inside the box until you guys come. I'm like, what the fudge? <laughs> Why would you say that? Like, girl, <laughs> just use the damn thing. Oh, it's my brother and I. Let me show you. I look so adorable. Oh. Uh, the, the girl, that's me. Weren't I a beautiful baby? And then... That's my brother and I. Sorry, that's like super... That's brother me. <laughs> People wide. Oh. I think, guys, I will do. I will go to the golf thing at three today. So I will stream golf related expo. Uh, I might or not. Either I might just vlog it. I'll have to see how how complicated the place is. And if it's actually worth seeing it, then I will stream it. But if it's not, then uh, I will just do small vlog version. Yeah, today's stock. I'm kind of talking about it, but at the same time, my brain's just dead. So I I'm saying really random things. <laughs> Thank you, Wu, for the tier one sub. Thank you. 감사합니다. Yeah. Uh. Something's wrong with my brain. Yes, we're gonna we should have done ETFs, but I haven't done it yet. I might skip that one today and just go with the two articles I read. Cause you should have seen it earlier, Jetty. I was just having this really bad brain fog and I just kept talking to myself. <laughs> I was like Guys, <laughs> I don't even know how I'm going to react to that. It's so bad. Can we call it a day? <laughs> Should we just do this? Ah, so I hate being fatigued. I'm so lazy today. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's be done for today. Yeah. Oh, I can't, I can no more. Yeah, let's just watch a movie. Movie sounds better. <laughs> I'd rather watch a movie right now than deal with this. Okay. Screw stock. Guys, do you guys have any life issues that you guys want to talk about? Your football team? Oh... <clears throat> oh no hey, jolly <laughs> no i've just it's been awful i just can't think i spent two hours wasting time you should have heard earlier. Are they doing so bad? Guys, by the way, uh, I will be going to play X Store Expo. 
tomorrow. I didn't know what was going on. But we're more like our each on an article. <laughs> so I want to tell you guys feel how hot my brain is right now. Okay, maybe that sounds weird, but just we don't it's so burning. This thing this brain is burning. <laughs> ah, help me. Okay. <laughs> What's 1952? What is he heat sick? That's actually a news? What the heck? <gasps> yeah, I have a really bad headache. Like, I keep spacing out and I've been having brain fogs. Like, it's been live. I've proven to you guys that I have brain fogs, right? You guys, don't you guys see? For those who watched me for like the past 2.5 hours. Are those those like liquid thing, Josh? Oh, the cooler? Oh, really? Oh, yeah. So, hopefully next week stock stream is not going to be bad. Blah, 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 blah. Actually, these days, I don't want to stream. <laughs> this is why it's so bad having COVID, because I lose my momentum. I hope so. Uh, guys, today, I will do this cake. How's that? Let's do you. <laughs> Programming is also bad. I'll show you. Guys, I bought a table just for this. Just to do this content. Oh. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Except this table is taller than my normal table. <laughs> Can you guys hear me? Okay. So, unboxing. Oh, thank you. Unboxing time. Takamash, change my title. What are we doing? So this is guide. Oh. The more you press it, the more harder it gets. 양모 분할 양쪽 끝을 잡아서 양모를 찢습니다. So they have directions. So there's needles. Apparently, if I do this, then it works. Yang Shou. Oh, 
Oh, this is for my fingers. Uh, guys, I'm trying to figure it out too, guys. Just give me a second. So this goes on my finger. I think it's to... Does this go on my thumb? Why don't they tell me where my fingers go? Oh, here! The instructions English! So, as the bottom of the workable, cushion the poke needle. It is not easy to break in the production. The front end of the needle has small barbs divided into large needles and short needles. Large needle. In production of early and middle, use long needles. The felting will be faster. It can quickly tighten wool, but it will leave a thick pull. Short needle. The felting will be slower. Use short needle in the late production. What the hell is thick needle? I think you're the thickest. Cockroach needling? Is that what it's called? So I'm making this character. But I don't know how. Funar Pangbo. Ooh! Look at this. Ooh, so this is my the heck? Oh. I'm felting. But um oh, did I read it as cockroach? Oh there's YouTube video teaching guys. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, <gasps> Okay, take. So, oh, here. QR it. We're making this. Okay, curl wool in a little larger than one by one drawing. What the heck does that mean? Ooh la la! Ooh. Oh, guys, I have white hair. Wait, but oh, I have to rip it. Oh, wait, this doesn't rip. Do I rip this? I'm so confused. <laughs> so I just poked this? What? Curled wool. A little larger than one by one drawing. Ah, one by one drawing. Here we go. Is this too much? I don't know if this is too much or not.
Let's watch the video. Wait, which kid am I? Wait, my kid's not available. Is it this? No, it's cat. I don't looks like him though. Oh, you found it? But oh, that's rabbit. Mine's cat. Ah, okay, okay, okay. need that Ah, was she Jungo Lema? Why, 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 yao Oh my god, I'm having trouble with this. <laughs> what the heck? No? Who wants to die? <laughs> we only have two for yes? You guys suck. Kidding. Okay, mind. You know what? I should have divided into head and parts. Roll it out. Oh, the tutorial video is 18 minutes? <laughs> Chaka man, chaka man. Let's, uh, wait, let's do, I can finish the head. Let's delete this one. <laughs> Sorry, guys. There you go. So head will include uh, the eye. So up to step 12. Up to here. Not this thingy. Yogo bargo. You guys are so realistic with the prediction. Oh 
Don't forget to vote, guys. What the heck? <laughs> what the heck was 10? <laughs> Twenty minutes is not long, guys. Oh, I should have muted. Ah, shh. Nothing, nothing. Wow, we have very nose. I can see who said the no. Wow, crow. Oh, only what? Oh, I only see crow with two K. Oh, it just shows you who spent the most money. Hi. Don't try too hard. Take my time. <laughs> Any knows? Yeah. You guys believe in me too much. Dolly with 3k, no. And then Farmer with 15k, yes. <laughs> Wait, we only have 3 for yes? What the heck? <laughs> we have 11 voter for no, but only 3k? Yeah. <laughs> no one got You guys don't like spending. Ready? Drum roll. Let's go! Ba ba ba! I don't know what this is for. It's for your future wife. Come on, I saw it. Why is this easy? Oh, it kind of looks like. Uh... What the way there? Okay, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Do I just roll? What the heck? Ani. Ani, why are you playing with me? Hi, ninja. Do I just poke? Can I cheat? Oh, thanks. Oh. <laughs> Wait, I can't watch the video? Are you okay? Am I doing something to it? Oh, how we need? Oh. Well, let's watch the video, guys. He just pokes. What? He just pokes. What? All he does is this. Oh. 
哦。Oh no! Now it stop. Now I can't do that anymore. Ah, uh, mangy sir. Hi. I don't know if it's art and crafting. I wish I had another camera that showed my poking. My nose is itchy. Yeah. But I don't know how to connect it to the OBS. Oh, I just poked my finger. I'm going to be on your feet. Ooh. Don't distract me, guys. Is this doing anything? What's SRT? Wait, what the heck? You guys, this is also scary content because I keep losing my mind while poking this. Oh. Wait, I have 13 minutes left and I'm still poking on this. Is that is this good enough? What the heck? I don't know how to make it go right. I'll say he's like neat and firm. Why so ugly? Oh, it has to be like firm. Oh, it can't be this soft. No man. <laughs> it's okay. Have faith in me. What the heck? Oh, it has to be like firm, firm, guys. <sighs> guys, should we just end this content? 
I don't like this. <laughs> it hurts my fingers. Honey, what's up? You're gonna have to check it. Oh, it got firmer though. So, my editor recommended this content. I think she wants to kill me. She's like, oh my god, this is so popular among Korean streamers. What elegance and grace. Guys, can you guys post some funny YouTube links? Can you guys uh don't know fun YouTube links for me? That's supposed to be round though. I need to figure out a way to burn your channel points. Some of you guys have too much. A, B, C, D, E, F, U, N, Y, M, N, Y, S, N, Y, Ch, Da, 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 Da. I was gonna make it very pretty and then make you guys buy it. Would you be able to use this footage for a video? Yeah. Ah. What the heck? What is that? What? I need sound? Oh, thanks. <laughs> thanks for, uh, fun sound. <sighs> Guys, by the way, new YouTube video's out. And then I think I'm supposed to change to a smaller one. Wait, I think. <laughs> Mangyeso! Oh my god, how did they do this roundly? <laughs> Guys, I think. Chocolate. <laughs> Wait, like lost its chin guys
Ah, and then they add a thin layer. I have six minutes, guys. You guys have faith in me, right? It got prettier. Talk about that. You go to the end, and then. Guys, it actually looks not that bad. Look at this. Face is almost done. <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know. Oh, I don't think so. Oh, wait, guys, we have four minutes left. Wait, I have, I need scissors. Face is done! Guys, face, face done. Face. They tell me I have to cut it. <laughs> I think you insert this one. I have to use glue. Guys, this can't be done. I'm on uh, step uh three. And um, the head step is uh, 12. <laughs> uh. 
Who wants to buy this? <laughs> Guys, I have no good taste in art. I don't think I like hands-on stuff. You know what I'm good at though? Pottery. Aha. Aha. <laughs> I'm good at stock. <laughs> yeah, I'm good at painting, guys. Guys, I will sell this character. His name is Muffet. Guys. Uh, then I just can I just say one thing? Just buy it. Oh guys, I do you want to see my finished product? I'm done. Huh? Huh? Oh, ready? 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 One, two, three. Finish. Yay! I finished it! Come on, you saw it. Hey, look in the mirror for a sec. Yay! Sushi Joey! Sushi! <laughs> sushi Joey! <laughs> Yeah. Okay, go down me. What's that? Guys, let's never do this again. <laughs> Guys, I finished the head though. Head. <laughs> Please get the name right. It's the head. Le head. <laughs> Can we just end stream today? <laughs> Can I come back in like three hours? I don't like this brainless content. I'll do a different brainless content. Uh, this one? No, it's too boring for me. Oh. I might just... Hey, mine went better than his though. How did he do it in five minutes?
Will he cut it? Oh. Oh. Wow. Hey, he cheated. You're not supposed to cut it. <laughs> hey, cheater. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, it's the same one I got. Eight hours? <laughs> Guys, I'd rather be a maid than this. Let's uh, in stream. <laughs> Let's uh, call it a day. You've seen enough. Um, um. It was good enough. Joey, do you have anything to say? Mom wants to eat lunch! Oh, really? See? I told you it took a while. Dancing? No. But I will have a, uh, I will have lo uh, two dance uh thing coming up. Oh, thank you, Jenny, for Jedi gifting crow gifts. Uh, thank you, Kamsahamnida. Are you fighting me? Oh, Kiowa. Thank you, Jenny. Thank you, thank you so much. Uh, I will do dance stream starting next week, Monday and Wednesday. Uh, I will do for Monday... Uh, be my rhythm. And then the other one will be... Uh, oh my girl. So those two I will do it. And then I'll, I'll wake up better. It'll be Sunday and Wednesday for you guys. So. Does that sound good? Any other questions you guys have? Anything you guys want to talk about? Ew. It was an old song actually. But it was easy so we decided to do it. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, and then I'll try to golf this weekend or maybe next weekend. But I have golf coming up with chat. So if you guys want to redeem points, then you guys can. Okay. Joey, say bye. Bye. <laughs> bye, guys. See you guys uh, tomorrow. Yeah, I heard about that one. Yeah, I'll take care of my health. Sorry for uh, dealing with me. I might come back at 3 if the fair is interesting. Okay. Yeah. Say bye.